I think a lot of people misunderstand what the mind is. Uh, you know, a lot of people think it's just our thoughts. Mm. But there's so many things our mind is processing. It's um, it's not just thinking or beliefs. It's um, it's the way we interpret the senses. The, 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 the senses give us this raw data, and the mind goes in and interprets it. Now, there is the brain part of the body that actually takes in and stores in some way you know, some mm. of those, like I know what an apple tastes like, and I know that I like apples versus I really don't like uh, fish, so I'm not going to, you know, I know it from seeing it. I've tried it before. It remembers, and it kind of has the taste buds and all those things that we experience. Uh, but the mind is kind of the, the interpretation in a way that it makes it good or bad. Mm -hmm. So the raw sense is this tastes salty or this tastes sweet, and then the mind decides, well, what does that mean? Um, that's why for some people, uh, someone who's very assertive and demanding and direct, we can say, wow, she's really strong, or our mind can interpret that, that, that information as, ooh, I don't like that. And so it's more than just the thinking that you don't like it, but what is the mind, what is the assumption the mind has made about that and, and the processing? So we're, I think, you know, when I was a hypnotherapist, I did a lot of like changing your thoughts. And we, you know, of course, it's, it's better to think positive than being negative all the time. Mm -hmm. But there's so, we're so much more complex than just thinking, it's just words. It's, um, it's a sense of who we are and it's assumptions of our relationship with outer, with that external stimuli. And the world and that's where philosophy comes from it's the mind of um that processes but also um is aware of maybe deeper concepts than just basic thinking 